long are home can jars of food good on the shelf? How do you determine an expiration date? Welcome to simplycanning.com where you can find um, home food preservation classes and tutorials and I will help you get your pantry filled. So today we are talking about expiration dates on jars of food. I get this question a lot and I've seen this question even in other places a lot. So a lot of people wonder, is jars of home canned food like freeze-dried food where you can keep it for 30 years? My answer to that is it's not a good idea. So the official recommendation for how long to store jars of food is one year. It's a quality issue. After that first year, food in the jars does start to deteriorate a little quicker. And so if it's been a year, don't throw your food away. Just pull it to the front of the cupboard and make sure that you use, make a plan to use it up soon. Now everybody will have a little bit of a different comfort level as far as how long that they will keep their jars of food. Depending on what it is, a little bit longer than a year is probably okay. Like for example, these jars of green beans are two years old and I'm totally okay with using them. I'd probably be even okay with three years old. If it were pears, um, anything that's a little more fragile, like fruit, tends to get soft and mushy in the jar. And so I really try to stick with a year for uh, any of the fruits. And I actually try to stick to a year for most anything. But some years, you know, you just have an abundant, we had an abundant green bean crop. And so I canned a lot more than what we could use in a year. Just depends. Another thing that will last much longer, and I am very comfortable using it much longer, is things like jam and jelly, especially full sugar jam and jelly. Um, those have so much sugar in them and the sugar does act as a preservative and so I've got jams and jellies that are five and six years old and I'm totally okay with that. Now there is a limit though and that's this is where I say everybody's limit is different. I have had people contact me and one in particular that sticks in my mind is they had a jar of beets that their grandmother had canned 40 years ago and I recommended that they not eat it. Um, I don't know what they finally did with it, but that's that would be pushing the extremes on that. So you do want to make sure that you know how the product was canned, make sure that it was canned properly with you know the proper methods, and you do want to make sure that that seal is solid. You don't want to, um, you know, if that seal is loose, then you don't want to eat it. And that actually goes for anything, even during that first year. Those are the two things that you want to check with your jars. So rotating your food is important. Make sure you put the new stuff at the back. Use the stuff, the older stuff first. Make sure you put dates on it, even just the year. For example, this one just has a year on it. Um, I usually put the month and the year, but at least get that year on there because you don't rely on your memory. You won't remember. Things get shuffled around in a pantry, even if you don't do a lot of canning like I do. Still put, put a date on your jars. So the result is one year is ideal. A little bit longer is okay. Rotate your jars and you will be good to go. So I hope that was helpful. Um, again, this is Sharon Peterson and I'm with simplycanning.com. You guys have a wonderful afternoon. We'll talk to you later.